Abigail. Whoa! Oh. I don't know. I've Abigail is a King Diamond song. Abigail. Only the nerds know that. Yeah, she's Kyle got, Katon and and no, nah, she's got a whole King Diamond. There's a whole King Diamond cas concept album, and, and you know what's funny about that one is Abigail is like uh, she's kind of like an anti-Christ figure in it. Welcome to Trailer Trash, where oh Derek's a nerd and talks about <laughs> King Diamond for the long. I love the Black Horseman. It's such a great song, and the one he did live in Philadelphia in the early 2000s is dynamite. Just wanted to peel back the veil there. Of this is it's just mostly him talking and me not understanding. The any worst of part it. is knowing me editing. I'm gonna have to include that. Oh, you do because that's our whole intro. So yeah. what are we watching today? We're watching Abigail. Now uh, is she oh she needs a babysitter. This was a Abigail. Uh, this was a <laughs> uh, trailer it. that we saw at the beginning of Immaculate. Immaculate. I love that movie. And um, in fact, be, oh, nearly every trailer we do. Yes, yeah, pretty much. We for saw the it. next month or two yeah. because they all deserved it. So this one, uh, so we do know a little bit about it. So you know what? I think we'll we'll spare you our usual conjecture. And I think Why we, should we ruin the movie for you? Let's let the trailer do it. The trailer is going to ruin the. It does. It, it does ruin it. That's, Roll yeah, all that beautiful yeah. bean footage. That's all I wanted to warn them about. The trailer takes all takes everything away. Well, if they're watching trailer chess, they're already good with watching trailers. That's true. And then all right, we got a little ballerina, a little Grace, a little tiny dancer. Vampire. <laughs> Whoops. Damn it. <laughs> I thought that was always a good. Buy my torso, tiny dance. These all came highly recommended. <laughs> These all came highly recommended. They say they came highly recommended, but I'm pretty sure they're going to do stupid uh, stuff. So it, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The, so highly recommended as cannon so fodder. Can't, can't possibly stop putting down her social media, but she came highly recommended. Elon Musk. How did they get Elon Musk in this movie? That, oh my God! That's the blob. That was from Elon Musk. No, it's yes, X -Men. it was. It's the blob. I know him anywhere. See you. I have a little boy. I bet you that little boy's dead. Oh, you know, this April. Do you know what a pinky promise is? Yes, it's where I eat your pinky and then promise not to eat the rest. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. <laughs> so, all right, they're holding them down. Joey. Yeah. I'm sorry about what's gonna happen to you. Ooh, uh oh, they don't get what it. The fuck? See, this you've got a lot of suspense for me. You could drag this out another forty seconds without giving much yes. more info, and I'm ready to see what's about to happen. So in the theater, we looked at each other and we're like, "Cool." But then, wait. <laughs> and then this is where they kind of lost us a little bit. Guys. Guys. Oh, uh, she's a vampire, yeah. a monster, or something. Yeah. What the yeah, I know. We were a little bummed. A vampire. Uh, a ballerina vampire. <laughs> well, I do like that. A vampirina? Okay. Ballerampire? Ooh. <laughs> Ballerampire. Oh god. See now they're now they're gonna be now they're gonna be dark Elon comedy. Musk is not impressed. Is that Dan Stevens? All right. Yeah. She's not hurt by daylight. Guaranteed. Guaranteed she's not hurt by damn daylight. Maybe. I don't know. Nope. Uh, I wonder if this will be one of those things where it turns out all the vampire lore we know is wrong and the only thing that can kill her is decapitation. Something like that. Maybe. Yeah, they're, they're, they're probably letting her live. Uh, uh, she'll survive this. Not, not for nothing. Her being a vampire, right? She doesn't need the ballerina is secondary because doesn't the vampire give her heightened strength and agility anyway? So it's like the van the You're ballerina gets a leg up on the other ballerinas in competition. I don't think oh, yeah, she's absolutely. Flying, if she can yeah. fly, then yeah. she could do like triple axles. Yeah, she never hits the ground. Turns out she goes to a very prestigious monster dance academy. <laughs> All of this would have been really fun to have discovered while watching the movie. Right. Yeah, the the, the trailer, unfortunately, I think Even the logo. The logo is great. Look at that, it's dancing with the headless corpse. Way. Yeah, but the logo also is a spoiler. Yeah, because of the teeth. Exactly. Well, yes. Because <laughs> Horse. <laughs> I was puzzling it out. Yeah, well, fangs very much. Eagle-eyed viewers may ah. notice. <laughs> <laughs> the very observant may have noticed that two of those letters were longer than others and ended in points. Yeah. Suggesting a fang, but it's, it's an Easter egg. Yeah, right yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, I guess you got to drum up a little bit of... Um, the thing is that, uh, you know, as far as... I hadn't heard of the movie until... Even a cold open yeah. trailer, remember Barbarian, gave so little away of its twist. This could have dragged that out to it that kind of point where it's like, okay, you've kidnapped a little girl under mysterious circumstances, and now you're getting locked in, yeah. and someone's disappeared. As a matter of fact, now, okay, I'd like. Oh. As a matter of fact, if they had done the and whole you got thing, Elon Musk in it, so you I'd did. Watch you it. did the whole thing. You do the whole thing, right? And um, 
instead of having her go, I'm sorry for what's about to happen, and then revealing the house is locked up, you have them go to open the door and you show everything locked up, and then the last line of your trailer is her looking up and saying, I'm sorry for everything that's about to happen. Yeah, right? that's fine, yeah. And then that's your that's the thing, like, oh, so the little girl knows the house is on lockdown, what's that about? Mm -hmm. You don't have to overshare and give it to it. Now, that being said, it's taking away some of the fun, admittedly, for me, but I will see this movie. Oh, I, I, will, I actually will might see go to the, the theaters for this one because this kind of looks like because the trailer took me on enough camp. of a ride. It looks camp enough. But now I feel like we can kind of map out what oh, happens everything. in the I'm, movie. I'm not going to be much. surprised. There'll be a couple minor yeah. twists of how they end up trying yeah. to combat her, but they're mostly running from her from within this house, yeah, trying yeah. to get out it, or kill her. Or both. Yeah, you're going to see how she dispatches people. Yeah, and you're going, one by one they disappear yeah. until, in the end, it'll be a woman that survives. It'll be Joey. Because she understands it'll be Joey. Abigail, yeah. and she's you know, going to help Abigail continue to be a vampire. Yeah. I've never had a they're mother. They're going to kill evil Jean guy Carl, from, Jean Carl Esposito, yeah. yeah they're going to the, kill him He's together. the real bad guy. He is the real bad guy. Even though this girl's murdering people. I don't know people. why or how, she's but he's the real bad yeah. guy. I knew that. Yeah, Abigail will be not a misunderstood. Not that bad. not that bad. Something about him is not that bad. She's going to be misunderstood, you're right. And then... They'll have to like liberate her, even though she just viciously murdered a whole cast she, of people. And, cause, yeah, but it's cause, okay, because guess what? They're probably bad guys. So she and Carlos probably a vampire himself. That'd be sweet. And and this is he's like, a Frankenstein. And she's lower in the chain, but you know, like a thrall. But she has to feed at certain times to be more powerful and potent to him, something like that. Maybe. I'm I'm, I'm spitting here. This I don't know. Spitting. Yeah. Uh, her anyway. parents were killed by vampire hunters, and he's taken her in. He's like a like, yeah like yeah uncle. yeah yeah. It's an immaterial. But, but he's no, he has real to be exploiting guy. her somehow to be the right. real bad guy. He'll be guy. the real bad guy. That's what I'm saying. She'll in which be a case, she's some hero. kind of thrall. Right. Yeah. That's that's an underling. Um, you know, that would make sense. I'm still gonna see it. When, oh, when does this come out? April something? A couple weeks? Uh, if only we had a show that was in charge of knowing these kind of things. The date's right here. It's April 19th. I think. Doesn't help me. Remember, they grew in fangs. Put the logo and make some fangs right here. I'm not doing that. Too much work. I better get some facts. <laughs> I'm not doing it. You're gonna do it. I don't know how I would do it and make it look okay. I didn't say it would look okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs>